So we're going to go ahead and move on to the tier 6. Now, the tier 6 uh, has a couple of special things that come about. One, you get more guns. Two, they're 152s. Um, and three, you get the uh, special airstrike consumable as well. Here it is. Now, note that the maximum range is like 10 kilometers, so you almost have to treat it as kind of like a torpedo. You're not going to use it unless you get close enough. Um, but like most cruisers, uh, you, you generally speaking don't want to just, just try to get into range to use it because it gets you killed. I mean, think about uh, think about like a German cruiser, for example. Just because you have 6 kilometer torpedoes doesn't mean that you're going to rush forward and get into 6 kilometer torpedo range. I mean, you could. But you're probably going to die doing that, right? Um, so there's that. We didn't look at the armor layout of the Celebes, uh, but you can kind of see the armor layout here. I mean, it's a cruiser, guys. I don't know what to say other than it's a cruiser. So, I mean, you know. Armor is not a selling point. No, dastardly, we are not on PPTS, we are on the live server right now. And once again, this is the build that I put my captain on, but we'll go ahead and redistribute that so that we can put more uh, IFHG funsies on. So we'll do that, we'll do that, 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 that. Four points remaining. That and that. Sure. All right. We'll get started, and then we'll do our drawing. Closing giveaway, drawing a winner, M-Captain! Totally rigged right there, totally rigged. Bainsmith is now following. Hey, Bainsmith, thank you very much for the follow. Appreciate that. M-Captain is here. He says, hey! Here you go, dude. Some subscriber camouflage coming your way. And we're going to go ahead and start up another one. Alright, we got 16 minutes left to drop in some more units. It's starting to look like an army, so that's good. Okay, so we are middle tier this time, and uh, the Dutch cruisers, generally speaking, if you want to use your airstrike, you generally need to play around islands. So I'm going to go ahead and make my way uh, this way. Uh, audio check, guys. Everything sounding okay? Looking okay? Anything you need me to fix? This is so nice, guys. This is so nice. Hey, Snow Mongoose. I'm streaming. Uh, the game is at 126, 100, 120 odd frames per second. It's buttery smooth as I'm streaming this. And then I've got, uh, I've got, it should be, it should be um, recording this and it should be at a six, six kilobit or whatever bit rate so that's great yes dastardly this is my new system sounds good looks good all right what's my cpu percent right now my cpu is at 60 percent and my graphics card is at 60 percent because i've got uh i've got uh uh software encoding so it's using the processor instead of using the graphics card on uh on twitch uh, on obs so I'd say that's working quite nicely, huh? Matter of fact, I think it's so epic. I need to I need to fire off some 510s. Oh yeah. <laughs> RCN underscore HMCS underscore submarines is now following. HMCS submarines, thank you very much for the follow. Make sure you hit exclamation point ticket to get in for our giveaway. Let's see, what are our topics for our Zath chat today? 
I wrote them down, and then I got distracted by other things. Oh, I didn't write them down. Oops. That's a derp. Um, skill rework. Oh, and clan battle tier 6 with two CVs. Yeah, we can talk about that. And I'm sure that if uh, Askins is still here, we can we can handle that too. He can he can jump in for that. That'll be fun. Oh, that's shooting me. Wow, that's a well done. I was coming over to torpedo him. I was gonna just start shooting him. <laughs> hey, well, bucket, how you doing? I fired at a uh, destroyer oh. permits, but mosquito. Who's targeting me? Probably the Devon. Probably the Devon. Although he's not long for this world. USS Addiction. Nope, it's not the Devon. It's either Breton or the New York. All right. <laughs> look at look at Chad. He says, "Heavy cruiser, my ass." <laughs> Oh my goodness. Yep, he, he got spanked. He showed broadside. And he got spanked for it. Oh, torpedoes. Oh! That's unfortunate because now everybody's going to look at me. Here, I'll provide a broadside target. Nah, don't worry about it. <laughs> That's the thing, because I was shooting at the helmet, the helmet over there. Alright, fire on the Breton. Oh, and not uh, to the York. double. Breton DCP'd. Happy with me. Yeah, I'll see if I can still fight on them. Now, I went behind this island. For obvious reasons, I figure it would be a safe space. And that gives me the ability to come back around. Uh, you can see I can't use my airstrike yet, because nothing's within 10 kilometers. M13! Nice. With the gifted sub to... Uh, who got it? M13 um gifted Munch Tiger a subscription. Ah, Munch Tiger. M13 nice. M13 um gifted a tier 1 sub to Munch Tiger. Thanks for that gifted sub, dude. Hey, RK, how you doing? Or our our Hulk. Sorry, our Hulk. How how are you, man? Just underscore Josh seventy eight. Alright, thank you for the follow there, Josh. Oh god. He appears to have DCP the flood. Yep, and he's also coming this away. Well, that's cool. I can actually show you guys the uh, airstrike mechanic now. Alright, so you have to think about where your target is going to be um, when they when the, the, the bombs drop. It's a certain amount of timing that you got to think about here, so I'll show you. I'm going to put my plane up just so I can ensure that I can see him. And I don't have to have full line of sight. I don't have to have a gun arc on him or anything like that. I can just kind of take a guess. I have to. I typically like to observe for a little bit, and then there we go. And then you can see here come the planes. And they're dropping. Here come the bombs. And I got two fires on him. Now. You know, I didn't, like, kill him or do a ton of damage, as you can see. But, uh, you know, every little bit helps. Uh, that DCP'd, so Breton DCP'd. So 
similar to torpedoes. Well, yeah, you have to be really good at predicting uh, what your opponent is going to do and all that good stuff. Absolutely, yes. I didn't get a bug. That's all right. That's what always happens, right? You, you get all excited. You're like, oh, I can, I can really get this guy. And then, nope. Oh, when I hit him with the one torpedo as well, so... Yeah, you're kind of moving forward. <laughs> a lot. Well, it was... <laughs> oh, took me a bit to get over here. No worries. Our Hulk, there you go. You got your Twitch mission. Awesome. And overbound. All right. Time for another error drop. Give him a turn. We'll pull it off. I have a feeling that he's going to slow down a little bit. I see it. I see it. Trying to help. Five seconds left for the drops. Here we go. And I completely whiffed because he turned. Doesn't matter. Yeah, I see that. <laughs> <laughs> People seem to underestimate my guns for some reason. Because you're like a carrier. He's, York. he's completely ignoring me. Because you're a carrier with guns, that's why. I mean, you see how much damage I just did to the New York? Mm hmm. I just real. I was trying with uh, over target markers mods, and I was playing around with them, and I was trying the, uh, the percentage ones. So you guys might notice it says percentage of health remaining instead of just uh, uh, straight up numbers. I kind of like the straight up numbers, but that's alright. Skyring is living dangerously over there. I'm gonna start pushing towards their cap. Yeah, you're gonna have to head south, I suppose, pretty soon. Alright, there's the scone. It's gonna kill our ACAP pretty easily. Yep. All right, you stinking Omaha. This guy has done a great job at surviving. I expected him to be dead a long time ago. Ow. Yeah, I need to turn away here. I got lots of battleships looking at me. I made the turn out, so that's good. Nice job putting units in, guys. There's, a, there's that Helena as well. What Helena? Oh, that one. I see it. The problem with that Helena is he's right. I can't. I can't hit him. Scone is nearby, so I'm going to pop my Hydro just in case. But I'd really love... There we go. Now I can farm some battleships. Okay, I'm going to have to switch and watch the buyer now because he's got my, my side. Mars is over there. Going. Yeah, I see that. Hey, Radiant, how are you doing today? You having a good Sunday? Skyrim. He should be going down. There it goes. I 
It's like I want to continue pushing that that scum, but I can't right now with this uh, iron on my broadside. Now we're down two ships. We're up on health, though. Alright, I think it's time to flip the guns. Let's put the uh, spotter plane up so I can continue bombarding the Bayern. But I need to get the ship back into it. There's the King George. Yeah, don't see the uh, Byron surviving much longer. Yeah, you got some good torps on him. Nice. Alright, King George time. Yeah, he keeps setting them on fire, oddly enough. Well, that's what a King George does best, isn't it? Lousy island. Great, okay. HMS underscore Missouri is now following. HMS Missouri, thank you very much for the follow. Probably gonna die here. Yep. Yep. Just couldn't do anything about their destroyers. That's okay. It means we get to play another tier 6 game. Uh, Missouri, don't forget to hit exclamation point ticket to get in for our drawing. We're giving away subscriber camouflage. I got two minutes to go until we get to our next uh, battle in Stream Raiders. Let's see how we're looking. A minute into the cap. Well, the only problem is if there's nothing in in uh, our cap to stop their cap from us, then it, it it's a done deal. So anyway, here's where we're at right now. We've got uh, 16 people in. It's a two skull difficulty, so hopefully we'll be able to handle this. Uh, but we could definitely use your help. We got a minute to go. <laughs> yeah, thanks for that drawing there. That was great. Now the Masacholi is going to get in here. Maybe get a couple of resets. Uh, makes the turn. But he's got to reset that Nuremberg. I just don't see that happening. Mm, nope, he's doing it. Let's see if I can get myself a hell now. Okay, resets. About half, but I, I'm pretty sure the Moss is there too, so... Oh, Helena's at 1% health. Is like 20 health, and I might get another shot up on him. Let's see. You got him. All right. Well, all you can do now is throw your plane up and try to hopefully get there for in time seconds. for reset. But yeah, I don't think it's gonna happen, huh? Yeah, it's 30 seconds until it comes up cool down. That's all right. Hey, Sharky. So, we'll be able to uh, do another 2-6. That's fine. Ah, oh, new PC is working great, uh, Weekend Warrior. The middle fan is fixed. I put that... Um, I put it... On, um, I think I put... Yeah, I put the, the front fans all on the uh, radiator controller for Corsair. And so, that's that's all connected. So, there's basically six fans, six fans that it's controlling. And then I brought a fan up from uh, the basement, one of my old fans that I never used, 
uh, from my original PC build from five years ago, put that up as an exhaust fan, and I have that connected to the graphics card. And then whenever the uh, whenever the graphics card uh, gets too hot, I, I put a pretty aggressive fan profile in so that I can try to keep temperatures quite low. And that seems to be working well. So, all right, let's get over to Stream Raiders. Um, I'm gonna run a 30 second ad as we start the battle. This is for pre-roll purposes, so stick around if you're not uh, subbed and you get an ad, no worries. And I will see you soon. No, not fan.exe Sharky. Oh, that's kind of loud. Epic Slimes. All right, Chris Valla wins some scrolls. Congratulations. And then everybody gets five gold each. All right. Oh, I got things. Flag bearer scrolls. Gold. All right, now we're on a three star battle. I think I did pretty well, though. Yeah. Oh, in our in the in the battle we just fought. Yeah. Yeah, it kicked me back to this to the uh, port screen, and I probably could have yeah, gone in and, well. and looked at it, it but did, yeah, it did that to me as well. Oh well. That's good to see the Monahan leaving this area. Now this is a different battle, top tier, no carriers again. Uh, so we'll see what happens here. Oh, um, we do have an East Day. Mm-hmm. That's true. Sharky, um, as far as fan.exe, no, it's a, uh, it's a, uh, what am I right? MSI Afterburner. The uh, EVGA software that comes with the, uh, comes with, you know, that you're supposed to download with the, uh, the graphics card. That software isn't really good. It seems to be really buggy. Um, like if you set the fan curve. <laughs> yes, afterburner.exe. That's right, Sharky. Um, so, you know, like on, on Precision, you set the, you, you set an aggressive fan curve, you hit save and apply, and then you close the program, and then next thing you know, it's back to normal default and your graphics card is heating up to 75C again. And I'm like, no, I don't want that. I want this thing to last a long time, you know? So. Alright, we do have a destroyer entering Charlie Cap from over here. Yep, there's smoke. I'm hard spotted. Gonna dive in for cover. This bit though, he's not what's spotting me. Waiting to see. Smoke to see if it stops. That's just spotting me. Okay. Oh. So there's two destroyers over here. Yep. Alright, so I got two hits on the Gata. And I'm spotted again. We got torpedoes coming in. There's the Nicholas. I flushed him out with my airdrop. There we go. And we've already lost a ship. Two and a half minutes. Oh well. Sharky, you said you have friends in your clan that built their own gaming PCs. How hard is it? It's not too difficult. You just have to have a lot of patience. Um, you have to have you have to spend a lot of time putting it all together. Uh, I'm gonna push. Because we don't have any uh, battleships over here. Oh, you have one. The Congo, but he's kind of moving away. Oh, that's too many friendly battleships, sorry. No, I'm talking about threats. There we go. 
Oh, did I mention I have Hydro? Lol. <laughs> now he's lit. Ah, uh, and he's crapping out Torps like crazy. Nice cross Torp, though. I'm gonna steal that kill. Alright, well, just like that, I think it's time I for me to back off. I just about pushed our Montecucco into torpedoes. My bad. At least I wasn't doing damage to him. Okay, well, management is the longest part for you. So, when I build my PCs at the start, I don't worry about managing cables. Uh, I spend more of my time just making sure that everything uh, works and that I'm happy with the overall appearance and stuff. And then what I'll do is I'll do an additional pass later on uh, to take a look at everything. Oh, thanks, Skyring. Oh, hey there, Omaha. Took that project to me, huh? Alright. Oh, that Omaha got lucky. Did he? I only got an old pen. Ah, uh, okay. On a broad side Omaha. I seem to find that more and there more. There we go. Oh, wow. Yeah, because he. <laughs> He started turning, right? So there was more of the ship to catch your shells. You have a Nick that's on the other side, but I will yep. here. I'm gonna move back. Let's see if I can drop a bomb I'm on drop him. him. I'm gonna launch my aircraft at him. You're here, hello! New toys, you see, huh? Yes, yes. New toys. So, camp management, yeah. I mean, so I, I built the PC, I streamed it. And then I went back to it later. I said, you know what? I really kind of want my old power supply back in this one. So I put the old power supply back in this one. Um, and that meant I had to rerun all new cables and stuff. So that's what I did. And it was fine. Drops out. Epic Shadow Flying Rogue. It's an epic, epic Shadow Flying Rogue. Not just one epic, Ooh, two epics. Oh, torpedo to flood. He's dead. Nice. Yep, there he goes. There he goes. Who remembers the... Oh, God. Yes, I remember those, Felipe. Once upon a time, building a PC was such a pain simply because you had these fat ribbon cables. Uh, they were almost as wide as your phone, right? Um, and they're still spotting me, by the way. I don't know where he is. Oh, you installed the ceiling fan? Nice. I should have put one in this room, but I didn't think about it. I didn't think I would need it. Uh, we put the lights in, and that was that was a great upgrade. Oh, I may eat some friendly torpedoes. Which don't damage you, so who cares? I don't know. I just don't like the... I don't know if they've hit it enough, done it enough times. Yeah. Oh, never mind. They ran out. It doesn't even matter. Yeah. But I don't know whose torpedoes they were. <laughs> who jammed? That's true. That's true. You still just need a Phillips head screwdriver to build your PC, lol. The secret is to have a roommate who builds PCs for fun and is willing to accept payment in the form of margaritas. Ugh, god. I mean... PC building isn't tough. It really isn't. Um, it, it just... You, you have to take your time and think about how you want your parts to fit and all that. Um, one of the things that I did before I built my PC was I put all of the components together, the motherboard, processor, AIO, RAM, power supply, and, uh, and, and the M.2 and drive, and I fired it all up to make sure it worked. Like, that was, that was the most important thing, was you make sure it works, then you build all the crap together, right? Because if you... If you put it all together and then discover your motherboard is bad, you're just wasting time, right? Because now you got to go and RMA it and all that kind of stuff. And you have to take everything apart just to get to it. 
I had Stevie stretching. I had that happen to me once. And after that, I, I said, I'm never going to let that happen again. I've got some good torpedoes out on that commander. I'll eat a couple. Right, Gave up on building PCs a long time ago. You now limit your expectations and just buy a good laptop. Well, Yerkia, you're, you're, that's not a bad idea. Gaming laptops have come a long way. I've had several. Um, so, ooh, big hit on the Furutaka there. Planeo, hello. When am I going into space? Oh god, I'd love to go into space. I'm not rich. <laughs> Do you know that today's phones are more powerful than the cruise that took us to the moon? Mm-hmm. Okay, good. Now that the Leander is gone, I can come in and start causing problems. I'm gonna hold off on firing for just a second though, because I want to make sure that uh, I can get in here. But what I can do is I can take advantage of Emerald's distractedness, possibly, and drop some bombs on him. And that's the oh. end of the game. Planeo, how is the Dutch cruiser line? It's it's pretty comfortable. I mean, hopefully you saw it there. I just kind of went in, shot around. I got shot up a bit from torpedoes, but uh, I I felt pretty confident. Hold on a second. I need to move my second monitor a little bit so I can see you guys better. There we go. Now I can read the chat better. Okay. Got back to port again. So let's take a look at how we did. Earned enough base XP. That's the that's the thing. Nice, nice. Came in third place. Yep. In the match before that, I came in second on the team. Let's take a look. That was the loss. Okay, fourth place.